I put on my menu lobster thermidor. <laughs> now I learned it's in the quarters and I learned how to make it, so I'm coming in this kitchen. I'm gonna change everything. The people said to my mother-in-law, this girl is crazy, she gonna ruin your business. <laughs> Nobody wanted those cream sauces. See, it was segregation, we couldn't go where they served that. We, could, we didn't know how to eat that, because we were not, couldn't go to the restaurants that served it. So here I come out with my lobster thermidor, got lambasted, so I had to back up. Do what I knew I liked to eat and what my people like to eat. But you learn as you go, so, and now we can go everywhere. I can serve lobster thermidor if I want because they've gone other places and they saw it and they learned to eat it. That was the worst thing about segregation, is you didn't allow people to learn. Look, if you let every black man learn, look what he could do. He could do a lot. But we were not taught. We were not able to be a part of that. Now we are, and look at what we are now. Wonderful. We got young people going into all phases. And that is a wonderful thing for me to see. I need people coming behind. I need black people to step up to the plate, get involved, do what you have to do, be a part of things. It's not going to be easy, you're going to take a whipping. But that's okay. Just keep going. What you did for us, we had an inspiration in the culinary community. because it's an industry that we will need all the time. 